Parkinson's was one of the things that they treated me for. And at UAB, they declared that I had Parkinson's. Hi, my name is Ron Edgel. My, my mailbox is less than 100 feet from my house. And I could not walk there and back without having to stop. I was short of breath. So these doctors were treating things that I didn't have. And in doing that, they were simply prolonging my getting well and getting better, or at least coping with what I had. Did it stop you from doing a lot of things? Yes, it did, it did. I didn't have the attitude that I had because I was pulled down. I finally found someone who treated my problem rather than my symptoms. And he has happily helped me and restored to me uh, well-being and a good feeling about myself and my condition and my future. And uh, I'm one of the happiest people you'll meet as of now. My journey started in 2009 and I have a portfolio filled with notes of visits and doctors and clinics that I had gone to, including some of the best. So we called and we got an appointment. <clears throat> and uh, I, was, I was pleasantly surprised from the very first as we went on through. Everything that we did, everybody that I met here seemed like they were happy in what they were doing and willing, ready to help. But the thing about it is, no one had ever told me before that my legs could be the problem. Oh, really? I had three total knee replacements, four back surgeries, and no one ever said anything about the swelling. They were treating things they didn't understand were going on. It was all here, all here in my legs. Four neurologists were not the answer. Cardiologist was. Yeah, we see we see a lot of people with what they think is neuropathy. Yes. You know, and, and they do and they do much better when they take care of their veins. So I'm just so glad after all that time you got some help and you're feeling better and you've regained your life, right? Oh absolutely, mm -hmm. absolutely. You know the day you put your shoulder your hand on my shoulder and said we're gonna help you. Tears came in my eyes and I believed what you said. And I still do. Thanks for believing in me, man. That means a lot. <laughs> Thank you, Doctor. It really does. Thank you, sir.